luck experience. Look at the breakfast. So today we actually have a little more time to enjoy ourselves. Um, we're not checking out too much later, but look at the weather. It's cold, rainy, overcast. This is the hot dog experience for breakfast. Awesome. Cheers. Skull. 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 Is this blueberry? It's blueberry. Skier? Skier? Skier. 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 With, Skier. with a little bit of honey yeah. and some granola. Good. Okay, so here's my skirt that I made. A bunch of cream cheese, cherry tomatoes. Hmm. Hello, good morning. Today is our last full day in Iceland. We're actually going back home tomorrow. Very sad. So we're just sitting here having breakfast at the hotel and then we're gonna head to the Blue Lagoon, or as my daughter would call it, the Blue Lagoon. <laughs> really excited about that. That's probably one of like the biggest destinations when you come to Iceland. We're gonna head, have finish our breakfast and then head to the Blue Lagoon. Floki. Floki, which is whiskey. Icelandic, Icelandic whiskey. Icelandic whiskey, so it's really good. And little Ava is getting a fresh squeezed apple juice, and we can't wait to get in the water because it looks so cold outside. It's gonna feel so good. Anyways, um, when we get our hotel room, I'll show you inside. I'm sure it looks amazing. Anyways, all right, let's get our drink on. The retreat hotel, and I'm just to say, this hotel is amazing. Amazing! Let me show you around. You'll enter here and look at it. Every 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 window has like an amazing view. You have a little like seating area. Again, amazing. Look at the decor here. I mean, look at this. And on top of that, everything here is complimentary. Let me show you. Look at all these drinks. All these drinks. What, what's in here? Let's see. What is that? I don't even know. Okay, we have beer, we have juice, we have apple juice, <laughs> wine, we have coffee. I don't know what that is. Okay, anyways, we have just everything. Okay. This is the worst like tour ever. <laughs> and let me show you the bathroom. This is so beautiful. Look at. Look at this. Look at this bathroom. It is amazing. Here's just the toilet, but here is the shower. Look at the shower. Rain shower head. And you have the controls here. You have the uh, Blue Lagoon products, which are so amazing. And then, come out, you have this wonderful freestanding tub in the room. And then you have a balcony. I won't go out right now, but, because it's kind of raining outside. And you have the view of the, <coughs> excuse me, lava fields and the rocks and big mirror. And uh, our balcony actually wraps around our room. And uh, here's the bed. And uh, I think that's a light up there. It's just such a modern, beautiful hotel room. 
They even provided us with these lovely ponchos if we decide to sit outside because it's kind of cold. It's a really nice little touch. Look at the beautiful artwork on the wall. These are wait, wait, the salt wait, 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 from the Blue Lagoon. It's pretty awesome. Eva brought little flip -flops. slippers. Yeah, and flip flops and a little robe for my daughter. Cheers to the Blue Lagoon. Skull. Skull. This room is, like I said, amazing. Look at it again. It's amazing. One more time, one more time. We love it. We haven't left our room yet, but we're on our way to go to the lagoon. So I'm gonna turn off my camera, and it's gonna be daddy cam from now on, because he has the uh, waterproof one. So yeah, hopefully he gets some good footage. Right? Right. Don't disappoint me. I'll try not to. Okay, all right, bye. In Iceland. back from our first dip in the Blue Lagoon and we actually had to go to the public area and not the private retreat area because Ava is not 12 years old but not gonna lie it was super cold and windy and somebody actually lost their drink they had a little beer with them or no wine and it just blew it away in the wind it was crazy it was that windy but right now we're going to stay in our bathrooms and head to the afternoon tea they have from four to five so that's what we're gonna do and then perhaps we're gonna go into the lagoon again a little bit before we head to dinner. We're gonna have dinner at the Moss restaurant, which is a really nice restaurant. They have five course and seven course meals and it lasts about two to two and a half hours. So we're really looking forward to that. And why not? Because it's our last night in Iceland. We're just gonna enjoy it as much as we can and soak in everything. We'll probably make a trip back maybe next time in the summer or maybe in the winter because I know the landscape is a lot different. So we'll go to tea time now. Cupcakes, donuts, and some sandwiches with prawns. She loves it. Coffee, cold coffee, and here is her cold chocolate and so boring just having coffee. Yep, yep. Americana. Americana. Cupcake is so good. There's it's like some dill. This kind of really tastes like hamburgers. Really good. The last thing I'm gonna eat is this Icelandic donut. Come on, focus. There. Lava scrub, the entire face and head. how to turn on the light so it wasn't like super dark in here. But it was very romantic. We cleaned up and it's been a long day. We had lots and lots of fun in the Blue Lagoon, but it's time for 
dinner. Cheers. Really cool how that guy came on a little cart and offered us champagne. It's like a dim sum cart, but yeah. Cheers. Cod skin with cabers. The brown one is a uh, malt bread crisp. And over here we have a barley dip on the side mixed with Icelandic yogurt. Wow. Enjoy. That looks really good. Look at all these crisps. I really love this yogurt dip. Very good. Ooh, there's sourdough and what's the other one? One with caraway with seeds potato. and potato. And look at there's the salt and the butter with skir, right? Skir. Yeah. yeah. And salt. So here is our first wine pairing. It's a white wine from Austria. And this is going to pair well with our first course, which is going to be scallops and cauliflower. Cheers! Let's go! Let's go! What are you thinking about? No, that's... <laughs> can't focus on you. Look at it. It's like blurry. It's because I look so good. It's from Burgundy, France. It is made entirely of Pinot Noir grapes. And this is gonna pair with our second course and it looks delicious. Here's our second course, which is like a beet salad, I think? Yeah, with blue cheese. Let me clarify this. This is actually a Pinot Noir, made from 100% Pinot Noir grapes in, in Burgundy, France. There you go. There you go. So this is the third wine, and this is actually from Domaine Curry. And you recognize that name from Steph Curry, yes. Go Golden State Warriors. Steph Curry's wine in Iceland. In Iceland, that's awesome. Hey, Steph Curry, give us a shout out. <laughs> hashtag Steph Curry, hashtag Golden State, hashtag stay in Oakland. We love Oakland. We hella we love, love Oakland. Oakland. Yeah, we hella love Oakland. To Steph Curry, oh, oh. Steph Curry, <laughs> stay in Oakland. Wow, it has a very, like kind of like a pineapple-y pear taste to it. Yeah, yeah that's it's really very good. delicious, yeah. Okay, so here is the cod, the king crab, and the tomato. Sun-dried sun tomato? Sun -dried tomato? Yeah. This is like the size of your head. Come here. Look at this wine glass. This gigantic. Okay, you can stop. Why? It's so much in there, okay? Yeah, let's fit as much as we can in there. Oh, wow. That looks good. So, have you... Uh, at the Chateau Neuf de Pop. What? What is that again? From Côte de Rome, uh, Chateau oh, de Boscatel. Uh -huh. And uh, this is a vintage of 2007. 2007? The 13 variety of grapes in it. All 13. Wow. What is that? It's smoked and it smells so oh. good. Oh my yeah, goodness. That smells so good. What is so that? we smoke our beef. Uh, and then we put it on the grill, and then we put it on this log with some coal, some uh, birch, and pine. Oh, and it's a smoky cool. flavor to it. Look how beautiful that presentation is. And round mushrooms underneath. Peachy. And then mushroom. a celeriac, and then celeriac and horseradish puree. Madeira sauce. Whoa, look at this sauce. Oh my god, it looks good. Wine tastes so good with our, with our steak. It has a very strong raisin flavor. Obviously someone's having a moment. Cheers. <laughs> it's hard with a giant glass. So we have four different types. Uh, we're gonna start with the mountains, which is gonna be Eider. Uh, it's mostly similar to common best. Uh, then we go on to Tinder, mm, which is our aged uh, hard cheese. Oh, here. And uh, next up we have Lyotur, 
which means uh, ugly in Icelandic. It's blue cheese. And it's a mixture of blue cheese and white mold cheese. And then we have our Icelandic blue cheese. Ah. And then to go with it, we have Icelandic honey, some berry honey. chutney, I'm and honey, like some uh, flatbread with. Um, mm, it has dried fruits and melon seeds. Good night. Good night. Good night. We're back from our dinner at the Moss restaurant. It was like really, really delicious and we had a really good time. The uh, service there was wonderful and uh, we actually got some really cool desserts to bring home. There were little madeleines and chocolates and our host actually gave us this really lovely little chocolate. And it's so cute. And it says it's the chef's creation. Looks like there's a little bit of pink salt, sea salt, and uh, chocolate. We're probably gonna head to bed, and I may or may not vlog tomorrow because I'm not sure if we're doing anything, but we may. Um, so maybe we'll see you tomorrow. Oh my gosh, breakfast. Look at all these pastries. the airport we just uh, finished doing a little shopping smoked salmon having a beer veggie pizza and then you have we do cheese pizza it's skull skull so we're actually on the airplane we boarded and um, yeah I'm really tired we had a really great time that's it um <laughs> it is kind of bittersweet that uh, our vacation is coming to an end. Time for a, a cookie and some other snacks and probably a little nap. All right. Bye.